We came here to Baltimore from Princeton University, where my husband Larry had taught American literature and American studies. Uh, they made him an offer he couldn't refuse. And I went to work at the BMA, where I edited catalogs and did development work and also uh, did the public relations. And I, I've always been a big aficionado of libraries. I, wherever I go, I try to find a library, whether it's abroad or in this country. I collect libraries. And we have, of course, the incredible uh, one at the Peabody, that one of the most beautiful buildings in America. My other um, particular interest at Hopkins is Evergreen House, where for some years I was the research archivist. And Evergreen has also a lovely library there, uh, designed by uh, Lawrence Hall Fowler, who was also the architect of the house we bought in Baltimore. So it all, it all connects eventually. Because our friends were in the, in the Hopkins circle, I met uh, over the years every uh, one of the library directors. And they were always good friends, and I became very interested in the library and was asked if I would be on their council. And then at one juncture, I... Uh, was the chairman, which I remember mostly from introducing John Barth at a meeting we had. So when I did uh, my, bought my first annuity, I earmarked it for the library because that was one of my biggest interests. Uh, this time, when I last did most, my most recent contribution, I had wanted to go to the program that Hopkins is doing with the museum, the Baltimore Museum of Art. All the time I worked over at the museum, I wished that there was more back and forth between Hopkins and the BMA, and nothing seemed to happen. I thought they should do programs together, they should uh, try to get students in, in, interested in it too, and lo and behold, it's happened. I chose to give my uh, money in a planned annuity because that has some uh, good things for me too. This means that I can get something back while I'm still living. In fact, I don't know any place else where you get 8% return on your money in this day and age. I think you should support the things that you believe in because it gives you a great deal of satisfaction to know that you can help 